scikit-learn OpenP lib SVM. I am using scikit-learn SVC to classify some data. I would like to increase the training performance. CLF don't you SVM SVC cache hua xian size don't you si tian probability don't you true verbose don't you true. Since scikit-learn interfaces with lib SVM and lib SVM uses OpenP, I was hoping that export open number threads equals 16 would run on multiple cores. Unfortunately, this did not help. Any ideas? Thanks. There is no OpenMP support in the current binding for libsvm in scikit-learn. However, it is very likely that if you have performance issues with sclearn.svm.svc should you use a more scalable model instead. If your data is high dimensional, it might be linearly separable. In that case, it is advised to first try simpler models such as naive Bayes models or sclearn.linear_model.perceptron that are known to be very speedy to train. You can also try sclearn.linear_model.logistic regression and sclearn.svm.linearsvc both implemented using liblinear that is more scalable than libsvm albeit less memory efficient than other linear models in scikit-learn. If your data is not linearly separable, you can try sclearn.ensemble.extratrias classifier, adjust the n_estimators parameter to trade off training speed versus predictive accuracy. Alternatively, you can try to approximate a RBF kernel using the RB Ampler transformer of scikit-learn plus fitting a linear model on the output. This URL? If you are using cross-validation or grid search in scikit-learn then you can use multiple CPUs with the n-jobs parameter. Note that cross underscore val underscore score only needs a job per fold so if your number of folds is less than your CPUs you still won't be using all of your processing power. LibSVM can use OpenP if you can compile it and use it directly as per these instructions in the LibSVM FAQ. So you could export your scaled data in LibSVM format, here's a stack overflow question on how to do that, and use LibSVM directly to train your data. But that will only be of benefit if you're grid searching or wanting to know accuracy scores, as far as I know the model LibSVM creates cannot be used in scikit-learn. There is also a GPU accelerated version of LibSVM which I have tried and is extremely fast, but is not based on the current LibSVM version. I have talked to the developers and they say they hope to release a new version soon. Although this thread is a year plus old, I thought it is worth answering. I wrote a patch for OpenP support on scikit-learn for both LibSVM and liblinear Linear that's available here, this URL. It is based on LibSVM's FAQ on how to add open support and the multi-core implementation of Liblinear. Just clone the repo and run sklearn build openmpsh to apply the patch and build it. Timing one underscore number underscore threads equals for Python plot underscore permutation underscore test underscore for underscore classification dot py. Smlib with linear kernel timing egg dropped by a factor of 2.3. RBF kernel, same. Liblinear with 4 thread dropped by x1.6. Details about and usage information can be found here. This URL.